Welcome to AfroCrowd. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to create and publish a new Wikipedia article. But before we begin, here are a few things you should know. First, you should probably create a Wikipedia user account. It's possible to make edits to Wikipedia without one, but just remember that without a personal account, all your edits will be traceable to your IP address and available to the public. Before you're able to publish a new article, your account must be at least four days old. And you must have made more than 10 edits. Organizations like AfroCrowd hold free events all year long that can help you learn the ropes and meet other users who share your interests. It's a perfect way to get in your 10 edits and also possibly make some new friends while you're at it. Click the link below to find out how you can get connected. Now, we're about to go over the most direct way to create an article on Wikipedia. Only use this method if you're confident that your topic is notable. An easy way to do this is to run a quick Google search on your subject. Have they been written about in any newspapers, books, academic publications? If you can find two or three of these, you're good to go. You can also use your sandbox and the article wizard to create your article. However, these methods are less direct and the review process can take weeks if not months. Your article may just end up in review queues for untold amounts of time. At AfroCrowd, we recommend that you avoid these indirect methods when creating articles. Now, here are some quick easy steps to help you create and publish your own Wikipedia article. First, enter the title of the article that you want to create in the search box. Make sure to write it using the correct spelling and capitalization because this is going to be the article's title. After hitting search, results will appear. If the article doesn't already exist, click on You May Create the Page. The article creation box will appear and you can preview and then publish your article, however short, after having added at least one very solid citation. Make sure what you've entered establishes the notability of your topic. Now for editing your article. At the top right of your screen, you'll see the Read, Edit, Edit Source, and View History tabs. At the top left, you'll notice the Article and Talk tabs. The Edit tab, or Visual Editor, is what allows you to edit articles. If you've ever written an email, using the Edit tab should be easy. In the Edit tab, you can create headers, subheaders, and paragraphs. You can format your text to be bold or italicized. You can hyperlink text to other Wikipedia pages or to external pages on the web. You can add citations. See our Adding Citations video for more details on how to do that. You can add bulleted or numbered lists. You can add media files, images, tabled and other non-text visual aids. And the question mark on the top right offers you help while you're in the edit box, including a visual editor user guide. The Edit Source tab shows you the wiki text markup which makes up the article. Certain features, such as adding images, are better edited in this tab. But if you're not yet comfortable with this option, Edit tab is your go-to editing tool. The View History tab outlines every single edit ever made on the article. And the Talk page is where the public comments on the contents of the page and raises concerns. Or congratulations! See you in the next tutorial!